Hey, weekly breakthroughs. Welcome to another episode. It's a show where we explore all the key happenings from the AI world to see what really matters. Grok2 is out. XAI's new model, Elon Musk's new model is out and available in beta version. Now, Grok2, it improves performance compared to Grok 1.5 across the board. Better chat, better coding, better reasoning. XAI, they also released Grok2 Mini. It is Grok2's smaller, younger sibling. So this is something similar as other companies are, are doing as well. So they release a family of models, larger, most capable models, but then smaller models capable of handling more narrow tasks at a lower cost. Now, both of those models, as mentioned, available in beta on the X platform. And later this month, they will also be available through XAI's enterprise API. Now, how good is it? How good is Grok2 compared to some other state-of-the-art models? Looking at the LMSYS benchmark or LMSYS Chatbot Arena benchmark, it currently sits number four. So it does outperform Cloud 3.5 Sonnet, it does outperform GPT-4 O Mini, but it fails to outperform GPT-4 O and Gemini 1.5 Pro. Now, LMSYS benchmark, it has new number one OpenAI has reclaimed that number one spot with their latest ChatGPT 4.0, 8th of August version. So Grok is pretty good, is right up there with the best models currently available. But what is perhaps most interesting about Grok is it is almost completely uncensored and almost completely without guardrails. Now, we want to keep this show safe for work, so I'll not be showing examples of that, but you can trust me, people are having a lot of fun with it and there's a lot of different, especially images available online depicting things that other models would not allow you to do. So, newest model from XAI is now available. 